Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So if you guys clicked on this, thinking it would be like a routine video where it looks, you know, super beauty guru and like really well edited, you clearly are new here. Um, so subscribe while you're here, but that's not how we really do things around here. I'm much more like, I just do the makeup, you know what I mean? I wanted to do this video because when I was watching beauty videos in like 7th grade and in 8th grade, I was always wondering how long it took these girls to get ready because I had school at like 8.20 or something I think it was. And so I would get up literally at 5.30 in the morning to do my makeup because I would follow along with these tutorials and stuff so I could like have my makeup look really good every day and I love doing it. So I'd get up so early in the morning to do my makeup but I also always kind of felt like lame for doing it because I thought that no one else woke up that early to do their makeup or something so I was like am I like doing something wrong like how long does it take these girls to get ready you know so I wanted to do this video because I wanted you guys to realize how long it takes me to get ready um I'm not even fully ready I didn't show my shower and I'm still in like my getting ready clothes I'm wearing a sweatshirt and sweatpants right now and it's sports bra you know what I mean it's like I'm not even completely ready but I really wanted to show the hair and the makeup because this is like my go-to look lately. You guys have also been requesting this makeup look like you would not believe. Like I have gotten so many requests to do this look and I don't know why. It's like the easiest thing ever but like I've gotten tweets from so many girls and comments and like comments on my pictures and stuff. Like it's crazy how many like if you guys want to see this look. It's literally the easiest thing ever but it's like a good everyday look I think so I think that's why you guys like it but anyway I'm just really showing you guys how long it takes me to get ready now by the time of this video clearly I sped it up it's a voiceover I'm not really talking through it um, but yeah you guys will see how long it takes me and I don't know this might be so boring for some of you guys but like I'm thinking back to when I was in like seventh grade this would have been a dream video for me to see and I would have loved it so that's why I uh, I'm just do it. Um, I guess that's really all I have to say. Make sure you guys are subscribed to my channel because I have a ton of content coming out and you guys don't want to miss it. And yeah, let's get on to how long it takes me to do my hair and my makeup. Hey, all right, so first thing is I normally do my hair or makeup, obviously, <laughs> but I like either do my hair first or my makeup. Lately, whenever I film, I've been tending to do my hair first but the time it takes is the same. It just switches the order. So this is me straightening my hair. Um, I get pretty distracted whenever I get ready. I'm either texting people or I'm listening to music and I'm singing along or I'm looking at my horrendous breakouts on my face or something along those lines. Um, my straightener is the Rusk straightener. I like it. It's pretty good. I honestly got it because it wasn't too expensive but it works out pretty well um, so yeah I tend to straighten my hair pretty much every day because I can trust my hair when it's straight when it is being curled or something that is when I tend to have some issues also you guys are going to see some really gross angles of me when I'm adjusting my camera so I wanted to keep them in sorry about that um, but as you guys can tell it takes me about eight minutes or so to straighten my hair and now we move on to my makeup so this is the First Aid Beauty Coconut Smoothie Soothing Primer, something like that. I love it. I'm obsessed with it. I think it's the best ever. This is me texting because I literally have the attention span of a five-year-old. <laughs> I'm also really tired of this for whatever reason. Okay. Um, this is the Becca Aqua Luminous Foundation. I pretty much use whatever I'm in the mood for. And in today's video, I was in the mood for a lighter foundation with clearly a heavy hand in the concealer. <laughs> so this is the Too Faced Born This Way concealer in the shade light medium. I am self tanning at the moment, um, so I'm a little darker than I normally am. As I'm doing this voiceover, I'm pale, but in this video, I'm tan. Um, this is the RCMA No Color Powder. I did an entire video about baking, if you guys want to check that out. I'm not baking today. I'm actually using this to set my whole face. I adore this powder. I think it's the best ever. So that's what I'm doing here. Um, let's see, what am I going to do next? Here I'm going to go in with Hoola Bronzer by Benefit. Oh my god, wait, it's actually like really cool to see me do this like sped up. Like I look like I'm really good, but like I'm not. <laughs> anyway, this is Hoola Bronzer again and I throw this in my crease and underneath my eyes to define my eyes. And then I take Gilded Honey Highlighter by Laura Geller and throw that on the cheekbones. 
really simple, really easy. And then I take whatever blush. Today it was Papa Don't Peach. It's a really cute blush. See, cute angle. I had like a quadruple chin. <laughs> now I'm going to go in and fill in my eyebrows. I am going to do an updated brow routine. I know I always say that, but like I'm going to do it. It's probably going to go up next week or something like that. So be on the hunt for that. Um, oh my God, I think I was just dancing right there or something like that. I really don't know. I talked about the products in my winter makeup products you need, which is also my January favorite, so I'll have that linked down below as well. And I go way more in depth about my new brow routine that I am obsessed with. So if you guys wanna check that out, um, you can talk, like hear me talk about it, but I'm also gonna do a video soon, so fear not. Um, yeah, then I go in with Kyliner by Kylie and I just put it on my upper lash line and I smudged it out. Everyone always asks me like, how do you get that smudgy look? And it's because I literally just smudge my eyeliner. Like that's all I do. Um, and then I put it in my waterline and then I take a pink highlight on my inner corners and under my raw bone. And then I go in with false lashes. Now the lashes are what take up like the most amount of time and I'm already at like half an hour at this point of getting ready. So it looks really quick but like I'm really slow. So... It doesn't take as short as this video makes it seem, no matter how much I wish that was true, that's not actually how this is. So this is me putting on my lashes. Normally, I never have any troubles with my lashes, but today they were playing me on my left eye, so I was having a little bit of trouble, as you guys will see. But I always first go in and apply my mascara. Um, I also have another video. Let me just like self-plug myself at every opportunity I get. Um, I did a video on how to apply false eyelashes for like everyday wear. So I'll have that link down below as well because I mean I do wear fake eyelashes every single day because I'm super extra like that. <laughs> I'm so extra. I can't take it sometimes. Actually I love it. But see this one just wasn't working out so I took it off. And then I moved on to my lower lash mascara while the glue was drying again. Um, I love false eyelashes. I just think that they look so much better on my eye as you guys can tell like the difference between my left eye and my right eye the one with lashes just looks so much better and so much more complete so these are the Ardell Demi 120s and then I'm going to line my lips this is Boldly Bare by MAC and then I'm going to put on Myth lipstick and then once that's done that's my makeup and that's how long it takes me to get ready so what was that like 40 minutes or something like that yeah I think that timestamp said 40 minutes Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you all enjoyed this. I do want to just add in a little something something here. Whenever I shower, um, I normally wash my hair at night, like after spin class or something. So my hair is normally dry in the morning and then I'll take a shower in the morning to rinse my body off and that takes like literally two minutes. And then I'm out here in sweats and then I do this. And then to change, it depends. It either takes me two minutes, five minutes, or like 30 depending on like if I know my outfit, if I know what I'm doing that day. It really depends, like average would be like 10 minutes. So yeah, I really hope you guys, oh my God, I just got, oh my God, my eyelash is playing me right now. It's stabbing me in the eyeball. I hope you guys, oh my God, I lost hearing my right ear just now. Okay, so I guess I'm dying. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'll talk to you guys in my next video, which will be on Sunday.